So anyway, let's just get going nice and easy here into Earth Day, acknowledging where we live, on which planet we are planted for just a little while. Just amazing that we get to be alive and we get to be on this planet for just a little moment of time. And so here we go, leaving the best legacy we can. Over and out, here we go. Healing this land, Tina Malia. Just open up and relax. Open your shoulders, open your back. can kind of let go of what you're thinking about, preoccupied with, thinking about what you're going to do today, and really just come home right here at this moment 
in time and experience together what Earth Day means to people, governments, officials, and people, just people all over the world today who are celebrating this. Again, it's the 50th anniversary of Earth Day, and Santa Barbara has worked really hard to put on a virtual Earth Day. I mean, they have worked really hard. It's a four-day um, event, really, starting today online. So you all have that link that I sent you this morning via email. And so I hope you enjoy this day today. And just let's, uh, let's feel it for the next hour as much as we can. Love this tune. This is Seminole Wind from James Taylor. Lovely little tune here. A little bit of step behind step, a step behind step, and step behind step, and then side and side. Nice and easy. Just warm up your ankles and your knees and your hips a little bit and then with a kick and a kick and kick and a kick a little forward and a back and like that just a few little steps a little easy choreography this is james taylor seminole win for earth day
doing these dances, I know there's some fairly new or totally new people with us today, and those have been who, with us for years and years. But in any case, if we do this a step a long time, like we're doing this, it's a chance rather than changing steps with each measure, with each phrase of the music, if we, if we get into a groove with a step like this or like this, it's a chance to feel your body, feel what's really going on, pulling in your stomach, lifting up to your chest, relaxing your shoulders, opening up your upper back. So rather than being like this, really opening it up. So with every step, you're working your glutes here, working your hips and your ankles. So if we do a step a long time, that's a special, a special little notice, you know, to that this is chance to really work your body, really pull it up, really pull it in, really work those muscles in the most healthy way that you can. So instead of changing quickly and doing a, a dance like that, it's a chance to, to really work on the health of your body. So we do a combination. Anyway, this next one, Makichi, many of you have danced this uh, for years in world dance, a, slow, a little bit slower version that we, we often use to close dance, Makichi, and it's from three um, indigenous women from America and um, they have put together from different tribes and they put together this music group and they made this lovely song. So we're gonna take it one and two and back and back. We're gonna actually use the arms that Teresa Singh brought us from the Bangla dance from Northern India. And we're gonna go like this, one and two. So I'm just pushing through, like pushing through the water, then back and back. So this move is a mirror or it's beauty. It means beauty like this like this or like this it means strength strength like this or this and this means love here and here here and here so you can do whatever you like we're going forward with one and two and then back back forward one two back one two forward one two and back and back forward and forward and back and back or forward and forward and back and back forward forward so it's always the same arms going forward but you can use whatever different arms you want on the way back like that so then we just have a rock step here and here just rocking one leg forward and the other leg forward a little switch in between a little forward and forward. So on this one, really just relax into it. Keep focused on the music and your breath and your heart. I always feel this is like rocking a cradle, like in the old days, really rocking it right down on the earth here and here and here. Just rocking your body, rocking your soul, rocking that cradle like that. Then we'll do a little bit of side to side and side. And again, just let the music rock your body side to side. If your music is, is out of sync with what you're seeing me do, follow the music, do what the music is doing and don't worry about what I'm doing. And then we have a little, a little step to the side like this. We just go side together, side together, side together, side together. And this, and this, and this, and this. And what we would do in class, in a big circle, we would be next to each other, and we would be doing this for the person next to us and feeling their life and feeling what they need and giving it to them for that moment. And then to the other side, giving it to that person. So that's kind of what this very sacred song is about, coming from three women from three different indigenous tribes for Earth Day. Here we go.
on that one. I, I sure did. I hope you feel where it all began, you know, for the earth and this country. And I hope you're with me staying in these rhythms and these these feelings and these beautiful songs that artists have brought to us that we can miraculously and magically share together. All righty, let's do a little bit of our Pachamama. Speaking of the earth, this is the goddess of earth and fertility in the Andes, Pachamama. So we're gonna do a little bit of cumbia like this. We're gonna go one, two, three. So remember you're going up with a beat. One, two, three, take another foot. One, two, three with your foot, or if your hips are not cooperating, just go touch, touch, touch. Other leg goes touch, 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 and touch. So as you touch, your hip comes up. One, two, three. If you wanna go one, two, three with the arms, however you like to roll it. If you wanna open up your whole back as you're doing this and express yourself with your arms or just keep them down, down, down. Down whatever you want, two, three. It's a little cumbia. Cumbia is a Latin rhythm, very one of the basic Latin rhythms. It came originally from Colombia. And uh, this, is the, this is the groove. So let's take one foot in front. Let me do it this way. Take your right foot in front, forward, 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 other foot. Left foot goes in front and you stay on that left foot. One, a two, a three, a four. One and two and three and four one and two and three and four. If you haven't done this before, it might seem a little, you know, it takes a while to feel that groove, but if you're into it, you can get your chest moving and your back and your shoulders, and it's a great way to keep that groove like one and two and three and four. Let's take a little bit moving forward. We're gonna get a one, two, three, a one, two, three, take it back, two, three, Four. So you can just take nice little walking steps or you can open it up and take big steps leading with your hip. You can go one, two, three, four. Take a one, two, three. Take a two, two, three, and a one, two, three, four. A one, two, three, a two, two, three. Take a one, two, three, four. A one, two, three, a two, two, three. Take one, two, and then to the side to the side. So as we've been working on, not just here, but here. So I'm working my lower back, I'm working my upper back, I'm working my core, I'm taking it back, and back, and back, and back. And then I'm taking my arm over, I'm gonna touch to the back like this, like a little bit of back, and back. Arm goes round, and round, and round, so my arm goes with the leg that's back, here and here, back and back. So I'm just opening up this whole part of my body, just open and open, and no matter how much flexibility you have, just make it a little more, just open it gently a little bit more. All right, let's just take it with Pachamama from the Andes, fertility goddess, here we go.
<laughs> All right. It was so amazing when we were out on the pier last, last Sunday doing this dance, and I looked behind our first time doing it, and everybody was following, and, and it was amazing. People who have just joined us on Zoom were out there just doing it, and everybody, oh, it's just... It was a thing of beauty. I hope you all saw the video and I hope you all, those of you who can make it to Santa Barbara on May 2nd for our next outing. It should be lovely. All right, let's take a little bit of that. Um, another dance we did out there, Big Yellow Taxi. This is Counting Crows. We'll do a little of this and then we'll go to the original we all know from high school or so, lots of us. A little bit of Big Yellow Taxi, the ultimate sort of environmental early song from the early 70s. And, here we go, let's do Heather's dance with, with this move. Oh, one, two, three, oh, one, two, three, oh, one, two, three, oh, one, two, three. I'm just going like this with my hands. It's just a little takeoff from John Travolta in Greece. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, or like this, or like however you want to do it. You're just keeping the beat with your hands, leaning back a little. One, two, three, oh, one, two, three, oh, one, two, three. You can lift up your legs and pull in your stomach and lift up your ribs and take it nice and high. Oh, bum, ba, ah, da, bum, ba. Take a one, take a two, take a three, four. So we're just stepping in an open box here. One, two, three, Four. Take a right, take a left, take a right, take a left, and right, left. I'm leading with my hip nice and deep and weighty, nice and heavy. One, two, three, four. Up, up, down, down, up, up, down, down. All right, and then let's take it to the side. We go step, touch, step, touch, step, touch, step with the arms. The arms go the opposite way, out, up, Stretch out your sides, stretch out your upper body like this. Out, up, out. I'm really working my back here all the way from my lower back to my upper back here. Really working. Bum, bum, ba. And then take it to the little bit of turn with a one, two, three, touch. Just step, 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 touch. Walk, two, three, touch. One, two, three. Three, take it side with a side and a side and a double to the side. Single, single, double, single, single. Let's do the footwork. We go heel, toe, step, touch, 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 like that. All right, here we go. A little bit of a big yellow taxi for Earth Day.
Pino from Joni Mitchell. Let's take this into a little salsa. If there are new people, put your feet together. Salsa just goes like this, back and together, forward and together, back and together, and take it to the side, touch side, come back together, side, back together, side, back together, a little, little bit of back, two, three, a little bit of back. All right, let's have a little bit of Joni Mitchell, the original song, here we go. It's called the three R's, reduce, reuse, recycle. We did this out on the beach. Let's take a few little kind of new steps. We're gonna go up and, so have your feet a little bit here and hip, up and a hip, up, hip, up, hip, up, hip. I'm just leaning into this hip right here, taking my arms out. So my arms go in and out, 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 in. So you, if you want, you can go up on your toes in between. Big a bum bum bum, ba bum ba bum ba. Tick it da, tick it da, tick it da, tick it da. Cross it back, cross it. We're gonna really use our arms in this song. Then we're gonna just walk one, two, three, four, step and step. So big, big steps going back, little steps going forward. One, two, three, four, step back, touch. Back touch. So we do it this way with a one, two, three, four, step, touch, step, touch, walk, one, two, three, four, step, touch. Now we're going to add the arms. We're going to go out, in, out, in, step, touch, step, touch, out, in, out, in, step, touch. So when you do this, really take your, rather than just here, I'm going out, in, out, in. I'm working my core, I'm working my shoulders, working my upper back from deep inside here, like this, like this. Then we're gonna do it step together, step together, step, step together, step, step together, step, out and out, out and out, out and out, out and out. Let's add this little turn if we can. We're gonna go cross, turn halfway around, since we're not on dance floors, we're all on different weird floors. So let's take this half and half rather than a full turn. Cross, turn around, cross, turn around. All right, 
Let's try that. That gets us all the way around. Let's try it again. Cross, turn around, and cross, turn around. Then just step, touch, step, touch. A little bit of forward, back as we always do. Just like that, and just like that. We might go up and down. So this is the step. It's a, it's a little bit of a um, learning curve on this one. You gotta really feel it, but once you do it, it's such a good step. So get all your weight on your right hip. One, two, three, four, one two, three, and your arm goes up and down, and up and a down, up and a down. If you wanna lift your legs and drop them, and up and down, tall and short, tall and short, up and down. With a little shoulders, one, two, three, one, two, three. I start the direction I'm going, right, two, three, left, two, three, right, two, three, just to feel the groove. Here we go, this is a great little tune, really, really, Clever little tune. So let's just start with up and a down, up and a down. Take it away, Genevieve. Here we go. this song and I love this song and this is John Denver and this is a um, beautiful song um, let us try to do our box step where we go one two three four one two three four one two three four and one two three so if you're new if you're brand new to us it's a box and you're stepping in the corners of the box you're starting with that corner so your legs go cross back side forward cross back side forward cross so those of you who know this well make it big open it up fill your space and let's try over to this side with your left foot going cross back side forward and across and a back and side and forward and cross back side forward so i'm working my whole body here keep your hips facing forward as if you have a flashlight shining light right out of your hip so that when you do these cross steps, you're getting this big, deep, nice workout that you never do in your normal life when you mostly just go forward and back straight on. Your hips need that, need that deep spot worked out right there that you get from crossing. Okay, and then we'll take our little skip forward and the back, same leg goes forward and back and forward. Then the other way, here we go with a forward and a back, nice and easy. It's just skipping, it's just 
Nice and easy. Let's take that one where we go right and right and right and right. So my left leg kind of stays where it is or my weight stays there in the middle. My leg goes out, then out. I follow it out and out. The other way it goes out and out. All right, a little bit of John Denver for y'all. You gotta have John Denver on Earth Day. Here we go. Mother Nature. Called Nako, and this is a very interesting guy and his band. And they are he is um he is a um, generation back in American Indian indigenous tribe and um, had a very interesting. You can uh, I'll share it. I shared it with some people this morning. His story um, coming from very very difficult mixed race background. Ended up in Oregon with with some folks and um, originally broke out and rediscovered his. Um, his origins as an indigenous people, as an American Indian. And um, and so he made this song called Backbone. And it's lovely, let us do that um, step that we just did out to the corners. We can do that a little bit, a little bit of here and there. You know how we go side, side, just letting the music take you, letting the music move your body. Don't put it there, just let the music and the rhythm move your body, use your legs, use your stomach, use your arms, use your back and move it into space as big as you can. And then we can go round and about and back and forth. Then round and about. You can make this really big and work your whole body out, back and forth, then round about, back and forth. And one, two, three, a back two three to the corner two three and back two three this tune is called backbone by Nacho. for earth day <sighs> Yeah. 
Napo, backbone. Beautiful too. Wow, wow, that's a groove right there. All right, let's do a little bit of um, this song. We, we heard a lot. We did it a lot out on the beach. This is our Pan logo. This is, um, this is this amazing. I was just looking for a song from St. Vincent, the island where the volcano erupted. Tomorrow it'll be about three weeks that uh, this volcano erupted, covered the island in ash and, and destroyed the infrastructure and made it really tough for people to live. And it's out in the Caribbean and it's St. Vincent next to the Grenadines. So I was looking for music to, so that we could feel and be, you know, just feel a connection with the people who had gone through this, this incredible, difficult event, this volcano. And uh, it turned out what they had was an environmental song, really, about their island and the coral reefs and everything. So we ended up doing this, and we're kind of we're kind of doing our little bit of pot logo dance here, where we go. So you're just stretching your leg out to the side, stretch it, bring your stomach in, pull it in, pull it in as you stretch. Really stretch your thighs, stretch your calves, stretch your toes, stretch it out, nice and long, and there and there. So your hands go like this. And they go the other way, out and out, and a stretch, and a stretch. Just to feel that beat and beat. Then we're just gonna lift to the back and make sure when you do this, you don't just flip back. This could be a little, not a little tough on your tender lower back, this step. So make sure you're pulling in your stomach. Lift and lift and lift. Try to get higher and higher and higher. And when we do this step to the back, you know, you can just kind of touch to the back or you can leap to the side, out and down. And if your knees are ready for it and your hips are all warmed up and ready to rock with that. Now let's do our little circle step where we go one and two and three and four. So you leave your right leg in place, scoot around it with the left leg like one, two, three, four, five, six, other way. Here we go with a left, two, three. Just doing that and in Ghana, this is the way they're keeping the beat with their hands, like one, two, three, four, five, and then this way. All right, here we go with a song from St. Vincent Island. Here we go. For Earth Day.
simple hula just a few moves for y'all so we're starting out with forward and together just a nice way to get your body cooled down and ready for the day I'll do it this way we're going forward then together forward and together forward and take your hip with you if you want a little bit of forward then hip together forward then hip together and forward and forward and then we're going to step together step to the side just step together step and step together step and step together step and step together step we'll take it like this because this gesture in hawaiian is for the land for hawaii 
for the island like this, like this. So one hand is toward the sky and one hand is toward the, the horizon, the landscape here. One arm is up and the other goes to the side. One arm is up and the other goes to the side, like that and that. And then we're going, we're pulling it in, pulling in like, like out of the water with the boats and the oars and the nets and here and here and pull it in. in. And then we do a little cross and together, cross and together, cross. And as we do that, we're with the beach and down in the sand and spreading out the sand. It's the beach and the water there and there. And then just forward, just touching, stomach again, take your hips down to the earth, down and down and keep them there. Use your thighs and stay down there. One and two and take it all the way. Big rainbow here and here and all the way down and up and up and all the way down like that. And the song is Rainbow and it's by Teresa Bright, who's a, a bright and beautiful Hawaiian composer. Here we go, a little bit of, we have a, a quick, another tune of hers we were going to do today. We'll do it tomorrow. It's a lovely little faster tune, but we'll stay with this right now just to cool down. Ah, so feel it, forget about your lists and your things and what you're gonna do today and anything extraneous. And be with the music and with your body and with each other and the earth for this little bit of time you have on this planet. Get with it right now and enjoy. Here we go. <clears throat> smell the plumeria or the ginger or the feel the, the mangoes all over and the pineapple and the smells of Hawaii and the islands and nature. Yeah, so let's do our balance now. Everybody, if you want to hold on to the wall or just uh, set your foot down when you need to regain your balance. But here we are enjoying the health of our bodies, our ability to stand up straight and reach toward the sky with our bodies. Pulling in your stomach, feeling that strength and that symmetry with huge gratitude for being alive and being together today on Earth Day. All right, here we go. Thank you, Genevieve.
then grab your blanket, grab your scarf or towel or shirt or something you can use that's a little bit long. Take off your shoes and socks and let's really feel our bodies now and get into that mode of taking care of yourself right here and taking care of each other too as we do this. Keeping together, keeping in solidarity with all we are doing. Plus we're planning a new, guess what you guys? That's right, Soul Biscuit. We're gonna have a uh, soul get down, soul funk party in September to raise money for Rwanda. Everyone is invited. We'll bring, we'll invite the town and uh, Soul Biscuit's ready to play again. And um, yeah, we're looking for a really great, probably an outdoor venue in September. You know, as long as everything is still hunky-dory with our Santa Barbara COVID, not so much. So yeah, get ready for another big soul, biscuit, funk, soul, live music. It's for those who are new to us, we used to do these events all, you know, a couple times a year and everyone raises enough money to buy a cow for Rwanda. And uh, so we have a whole flock, a whole herd of cows in Rwanda named after soul, biscuit, Shaka for Shaka Khan, who was Ed's, Ed's good friend and Eddie and their whole herd of cows from our soul funk dance parties. And it's the kind of thing where you come there and normally you never stop. Nobody ever sits down because the music is so good and we dance and dance and dance the whole time, just rocking out. It's just so good. That groove from the 60s, 70s is, uh, is a thing of beauty. So everybody just let's get uh, looking forward to some really good outdoor fun and May 2nd to start it off at the beach. So put your, uh, put your legs down there, both knees to one side, keep your upper back on the mat and then cross those legs and open up your, open up your hip and your lower back, stomach in and breathe and relax into the earth. This fun little speck of cosmic dust that we got to be upon for a little while, this earth, this little ball of cosmic fun, yeah. Take it to the other side and roll it on out and cross your legs if you want to to get that deeper stretch and really let gravity, let that strange and magical, I mean, think about it, gravity, you know, like, are you kidding me? How does that work? I mean, how does it work keeping us from flying away? I mean, gravity. So. Let's have a little shout out to gravity and let your body sink into it. Let it grab you. Let gravity grab you right here, right now. And take some big deep breaths into the, into the stratosphere and then down, relax it into the earth. All the way through your body, opening up, stretching it out. All right, roll it on through again. Just make it nice and easy and take that heavy weight down into that earth, down and down. Put your feet down then. We're gonna pull on your, engage your core, strengthening your core, pulling your core muscles. Squeeze in your waist with your hands, like push it in. And then, and then try to keep it in there using your muscles. 
really engage and squeeze and pull like crazy and then get your feet going on while your core is really working, just pulling in deeply in these deep muscles, pulling in your waist and keeping your legs moving while you're grabbing into your core, really engaging those muscles and breathing big, big, big breaths. And if you want, keep get those legs going in a big bicycle. But if that's too hard, just forget about it and grab your knees and relax your back. But if you can keep on going, working that core into a nice big bicycle with big stretched out legs and flex your leg on the way back, point it and flex it and point, stretch, stretch, stretch. Really get it going on there and open and stretch it and lengthen and then leave one leg out there work those ankles work that wrist with your hand above your head all the way up and up and up stretch it out other arm stretch it out really roll those joints take some care take some attention to those beautiful ankle joints and wrist joints all the way out and all the way out and just keep it going, stretching out, engaging your core, stretching out your limbs, out, out, a little bit more each time, like that. All right. And engage your, and just let your back go now, bring your knees up to your chest and relax your lower back, put your feet down, lift your hips up, and let's go nice and tall, squeeze your butt, squeeze it really tall, squeeze it really tight. Take it all the way up, squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Stretch your hands above your head if you like to stretch out your entire body. I love doing this. I hope you love it too. Take it down, down, down. Squeeze your butt, 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 and then let it go, go, go. And then again, all the way up. Squeeze that butt as you go and squeeze it tighter when you get up to the top. Take a big, big, huge breath up there at the top. And let it descend, let it go. Whew. And then one more time. Take it all the way up and up and up and up and up. There you go. Up, up, up. Ah. And take it down and down and relax that. And then grab your scarf or your towel or your whatever sweatshirt. Something so you can relax. So this is the way most people stretch. You know, they, they stretch their hamstrings like this. You know, but it can be a strain on your lower back. So this is why we do it without back engagement, just your leg. And it's so, so important. I'm, I feel so bad when people leave before the floor work because this part is so important to keep these muscles loose. If you can do this a couple of times a day to keep those hamstrings flexible and nice because when you pull one of these babies, man, it's, it's for real. It takes a long time to heal. Those of you who have done it as Raise your hand, me. Uh, you don't want to be, you want to keep really good care of these hamstrings here. So, all right, take it away. We've got a little bit more JD, cause it's Earth Day. Here we go, Genevieve, thank you. <clears throat> this goes out to Juanita. <laughs>
other side. nice big breath into the light, into the day, into your life, and then just relax. Thank you so much, everybody. Happy Earth Day. Happy 50th anniversary of Earth Day. We'll keep doing these Earth Day songs through the weekend, too, for those who couldn't make it today. And just like that. All righty. Thank you, Janet. You are so welcome. Thanks, everybody, for coming to class. Hope you have a lovely day out there.